Hey guys, Shea Bear 1000 here. Today we're going to be trying out this product right here. It's called Plug and Safe. Stay tuned. Okay guys, what we have here is a product I've never seen before, you guys may have called plug and safe now what you do is you can plug in a radio or a lamp you know a light you can put it somewhere like by your door or whatever and what it does is when it hears the door open it turns that product on it welcomes welcomes you home using a process that detects inaudible sound pressure waves we call this technology sonic vibration. It is totally safe for you, your family, and pets. Never come home to a dark house again. So, what we're going to do is we're going to open this up right now and check it out. And then we're going to try it out. How's that? I got something we can try it out on. So, easy opening packages. Now, we, we just found this at, a, at like a thrift store, so, um, you know, no one's being endorsed here on my part or theirs. There's some instructions. You plug it into the wall, plug in a lamp or electrical device that will turn on when power is turned on. Of course, it says make sure the lamp is in, you know, the on position. <clears throat> And tells you how to set it up. Let's, let's get this out of here. So, uh, we gave, what did we get for this? Uh, we gave $7 for it. So, oh, sale. It was $14.99. So, check this out. And there's another little book that is kind of like that little glue on it. It's a setup guide, tells you how to set it up. You know, don't give you warnings and stuff like that. It's a little book. Tells you how to do this. So, what I want to do is, here, let's check this out. See this? You can adjust this for the sensitivity. You know, so, a little error there. And, so that's what you do. So it says, here, quick guide here. One time setup. It says set the sensitivity dial straight up position while plugged in. Tap the unit with your fingertip. You will notice a little red light turn on. That little red light is right there. Now, okay. Go to the door window you are wanting the PS8 to monitor. With a fist, bang on the door. You should notice the little red light turn on. Hmm. By turning the, sensitive, the sensitivity control up or down, you can set the PS8 to the right sensitivity. If you turn the sensitivity lower and the light does not turn on when the door is being banged, you have set it too low. You should find the position the light just turns on. You should find, what the hell does that mean? You should find the position the light just turns on. This is generally in the 10 to 12 o'clock position. So that, I guess, is going to be... Like right in, oops, right about, right about there. Okay, so guys, hang on a second. Let's uh, let's go get this plugged in. Let's try it out. Okay, guys, we have it plugged in to the wall underneath this little table, and this is what we're going to operate. Operate. That's a little night light. It's a uh, lighthouse, but it's a little night light. So we're going to go over here and. 
Let me see. Let me grab them instructions again. And see what's going on here. So, if that works, it's pretty cool because the outside light comes on when we pull up. But when we come in the house, I usually walk over here into the kitchen and turn the lights on for her to see to come in. This way, this light will come on at night and I can see it. So, in case I'm 12 o'clock, while plugged in, tap the unit with your fingertip. Let's see if the light comes on. And it does. Okay. Go to the door window whichever one you're using, going to monitor. With a fist, bang on the door. You should notice the little red light turn on. And it did. Funny monkey, she said, ouch. And it did. I'm making a video, that's what I'm doing. <laughs> you gotta bang on the door. Okay. Now, by turning the sensitivity control up or down, you can set automatically. If it turns, okay. So, all right. Let's open and close the door and see if it. There it is. All right. Let's plug the light in and see what happens. Now, okay, the light is on. That's on. So it says we got to wait 30 seconds. I'm not going to bore you with that. I'm going to pause you. Okay, now we think we have it set up. And I'm going to have Monkey right here when I tell her to, to open the door. And we should see this pretty little lighthouse light up. So let me get this set up. Okay, Monkey, open the door. Let's see if this comes on. It came on, and then after three minutes, it will shut off. That's cool. So I am going to turn the sensitivity down just a little bit because she was fucking with me a little bit ago. Was not. And shut the bathroom door real hard, and the bathroom door is right on the other side of here, so it will make it do that sometimes. So anyway, that's, that's that little item. Let's see if I can get you down here. So you can get another look at it again. You're on the top. And there it is. It's right under there. So, there we go. So that's pretty cool little gadget, huh? Yeah. So we're going like. yeah, to try it out for a couple days. Mm -hmm. And um, see what we think of it, huh? Yeah. So after three minutes it'll shut off. Then when you open the door it'll come back on. That's so. Nice. Yeah, so that'll be a little night light for him when we come in and I go over there to turn on the big light for us. So, guys, there's that. Now, also, <clears throat> what I want to tell you, I had a uh, one of our subscribers, shoot, Nancy Jones. Hi, Nancy. Uh, she wanted me to do that um, What the Fluff Challenge with Bruno. And I had never heard of it, so I watched the videos on it. Uh, when you hold up a blanket and and you're like by a door and you kind of drop it and step in the door and disappear he didn't fall for it. he knew where i was every time so it didn't work i mean i'm not gonna put it up uh so that's why you won't see it nancy but i did do that trust me i do have the the footage of it but it didn't uh he uh he didn't fall for it. he he knew right where i was he's pretty smart uh it's like them little laser lights. I got a laser pointer. He won't chase it. He looks right up in my hand. He knows where it's coming from. But anyway, I did try it, Nancy. So thanks for the challenge. And uh, think of some more, you know, you guys. And and uh, we'll come up with some other stuff. So I'm going to get this video up for you guys. Oh, yeah, by the way, uh, this past weekend we went to um, Crystal Rip. Where'd we go? We went to Gainesville. <laughs> anyway, we went to Gainesville last this past weekend. And uh, we went to the butterfly exhibit. Now, I've got some still images, but for some reason, I did my intro and everything. 
this camera didn't save it so I do have some some um, footage of us at the haunted restaurant which I was just uh, really there um, we just ate but I, I did try some really hot sauce their hot sauce for their wings I do have that footage and I do have some still images all through in of the butterfly exhibit I got some of those that it did save so I don't know why it didn't save the um, the footage of the video so anyway I'm rambling so I'm going to get some more videos up for you guys so that being said remember Shea Bear the myth the man the legend I'm gone you guys have a great week bye bye now see ya